Hello, Shavers. Um, it's me again. Uh, I'm back. Kind of had some stuff going on last week. I actually shaved off camera, though. Um, I had some things, you know, I just didn't really have time. Um, so today I'm just trying to use up some of my samples. I've got the x -Pack. Um, I like it. It's a nice, uh, it's a nice barbershop scent. Uh, expensive. So that's why I had gotten the sample. So, uh, I'm going with my Boca Barbolito. My Savile Row 3224. I've got it preloaded already since it's in a sample. So, I'm just going to wet my face real quick. Uh, just showered as usual. I like to shower before I shave. Several rows, she's definitely a little dry. Dokaro, yeah, we can get some freaking water in here. I normally don't lather my whole face. But I felt like doing it. All right. I don't even know how I'm gonna shave my face today. This is kind of just a, on a whim. Trimmed it all up to pretty much the same length. Thinking in my head, there's a lot of debate on XPEC and uh, whether it's worth its weight. I don't want to come to any uh, early conclusions. I mean, it's been a while since I've used this. Um, I like the scent. Um, as in a shaving cream itself, huh?
Seventy dollars, huh? Now what I can tell you guys is in my opinion I think Martin DeCandre is worth its weight for the fact that it, it is a beautifully uh, beautifully made so it's been around quite some time in the process of making it actually makes it last a long freaking time you get a jar of that 70 bucks right now the process it's triple milled Now, when it's triple milled, it's usually a hard soap. You get a jar of that, you definitely shave with that every single day for a year. Expect being a cream. I don't know if you could do that. I've been wet shaving for a little while now. I've tried other soaps, you know, and I've seen what, what's out there. I definitely think there's some other uh, good brands. Rinse it off. I think you're really paying seventy dollars for the scent. Good cream lathers right up. Smells good. I mean, you um, know, I don't know, $70. I don't know, it kind of gets me. I'll just keep buying samples. Five, six dollars. <laughs> you know. Clean up.
I don't know. Barrister Man, I think, is a, uh, you know, it definitely is outperforming us. I mean, I'm getting a good shave. It's, you know. But uh, I don't know. I don't feel like it's drying out on me, too. It's definitely drying up. Definitely dried out. I mean, that's not that's not good. All right, folks. Um. Okay, so let me give you some thoughts over here on uh, the expect. Smells good. Um, it's a barber scent. Um, it's definitely a grandfather scent, you know. But uh, that doesn't mean anything to me. I should, you know, I wear a lot of stuff that'll uh, could be considered old man. I don't know. That's just me. I like that stuff. Um. Residuals, eh, it kind of felt, left my skin feeling soft, you know, during the shave. Um, slickness, I don't know. No, you know, it dried out on me. Uh, I mean, that possibly, that could be my fault, but, you know, who knows. Um, and, uh, all right, I'm going with uh, the Pinot Club Man, regular classic. And, uh, I just don't think you get enough bang for your buck. I could justify Martin DeCondre being that because it's a hard puck, triple milled. You could use that forever. Expects cream. I don't see that lasting very long. Um, and, uh, if it's a special occasion thing, I've got other creams that I would use for a special occasion. So... No, I expect, I don't think, gets my vote. I think I would be the smarter consumer, and instead of going out and buying a $75 tub, I think I would buy a $5 sample, use it whenever. You get about, I give you one of these. I got three shaves, four shaves out of this, so how many times a year am I going to use I expect? Right. Ladies and gentlemen, today was the Savile Row 3224. Polished it off with some Panoa Club Man. Before that was the Dickinson's Witch Hazel. And the Shredder was the Boker Arbolito Spanish Point. Hope everybody had a good weekend. Uh, hopefully I'll be back uh, on my regular schedule with the shaving. If not, you know, I will see you.
on the next episode.